Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello if you're new. Make sure that you subscribe before you leave. That way you'll never miss out on another bay leaf video. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys five ways you guys can use bay leaves or a bay leaf to attract money. So these are tried and tested ways that I use personally myself and I wanted to share it with you guys. But before we get started, I do wanna let you guys know I just wrote my first book. It's an ebook and it has all of these rituals in it plus more uh, rituals to attract love and money, abundance, healing, protection, cleansing. So it's 30 different rituals, very basic, easy rituals you can do at home. If you're interested in that book, it is up on Amazon now and you can purchase that. Okay, so now I'm gonna share with you guys five ways you can attract money using bay leaves. So these are gonna be super simple, super easy, and they work and they create a very, very high money vibration. What you wanna do is take your wallet, and basically just put a bay leaf in there with your cash. That's it. Now you can write something on your bay leaf. You can write an amount, you can write dollar signs, you can write an affirmation like I am a money magnet, abundance flows to me easily. Whatever you write, make sure that it resonates with you. Whatever you write on your bay leaf, it has to ignite excitement within you because that is the highest vibration that you could possibly conjure and so remember that whatever you write whether it's on candles bay leaves affirmations make sure that it sparks something within you write it in a way that it excites you and that it's believable to you and it will work okay the second way you can use a bay leaf to attract money is by using an oil. So here is a little sample of my personal money oil. This money oil I've been having charged for over five years and it has all the ingredients and herbs and crystals in it that attract money. Very high prosperity vibrations. Um, if you guys are interested in this, it's up in my store. But if you don't have this, you can definitely just use grapeseed oil you could use cinnamon oil you can use olive oil is a really good one so if you don't have money oil you can use those oils you can even use coconut oil so what you're gonna want to do is write an amount or an affirmation on your bay leaf remember this has to excite you okay so what i would write is like i'm just gonna actually be doing this for myself along with you guys so what i'm going to write i love to do this I love to write four dollar signs. The reason I write four is because I want to kind of draw in money from all different directions, from the north, east, west, and south. So after I write my dollar signs, of course you want to write your name on there too because you want to direct the energy towards you. The next thing you want to do is take some of your oil, just a tiny, tiny bit. Remember, you don't want to like make your leaf wet. You just want a little drop that's it. It's a tiny amount and you just want to kind of rub that all over and now your bay leaf is ready to burn. Now a quick tip when you're burning your bay leaf, you want to not hold the bay leaf in your fingers. So I like to use like some scissors. These are um, eyelash scissors, <laughs> but it works. Okay. So now that my bay leaf is secured in my scissors, you can also use tweezers, pluggers, um, little scissors, big scissors, whatever you can use that where you're not using your hands. Um, and then you just want to light your bay leaf and that's it. You see how that was such a nice clean burn? That means the energy is really good. So I'm sending you guys this energy too. Okay, the next way I'm going to show you guys how you can manifest money with a bay leaf is using a bay leaf and two other ingredients. These ingredients uh, have very high vibrations of attracting things fast, of building more energy into your intention, and they're really, really good herbs, I would say, maybe. Um, but basically, what you wanna do first is, of course, get your bay leaf, and you want to write your money affirmation. I'm gonna write the same exact thing. You can, you can write something different. And it's okay to do like three different bay leaves with three different money intentions. You can, that's fine. Like that's, I get a lot of questions asked and that's perfectly fine. Okay, so for this, you're going to need coffee. Now, I wouldn't use instant coffee. I'm using like uh, dried coffee grounds. This, this has been used by me. Like I just kind of collected it and dried it. And you just kind of want to sprinkle that in the fire safe bowl that you're using or the abalone shell that you're using. Um, what coffee does is it amplifies the energy of your intention and it helps to attract this 
faster to you. The next thing you want to use is cinnamon. Ground cinnamon, you can use cinnamon, um, crushed cinnamon, like whatever you have, right? Just a little bit. You just wanna sprinkle that on the bottom of your bowl so that when your bay leaf is burning, the herbs can burn along with it and just amplifies everything. Adds really good energy, um, really makes your intention high vibe and all that. So again, secure your bay leaf in something where you're not gonna be touching it and then you just light it. And you drop it right on top of your herbs. Be careful here, you, you wanna be safe when you're working with herbs and fire. And right away, like the cinnamon burnt along with the bay leaf, the coffee burnt along with the bay leaf. And what you could do with the ashes is sprinkle it in your front yard. You could just um, blow it out into the wind. You can add the ash to your wallet, um, rub a little bit on your money, um, your credit cards, debit cards, you know, all that stuff. Sprinkle some in your purse, or you could throw it away if you want to. But I wouldn't throw it away because this is like, this has just been charged with your intention of money, so it's pretty powerful. So the fourth way that you can use a bay leaf to attract money, with this, this is a very, very powerful way because you're using sound energy, you're using the energy of cash, bay leaves, it's very, very powerful. So what you're going to need is a singing bowl, a Tibetan singing bowl. Get yourself a singing bowl, and then what you're going to do is put your cash inside your sing singing bowl. So. Here I have a $20 bill. You could use a hundred, you could use a $1 bill, you could use pennies, whatever you have. And you're going to want a bay leaf, but you're gonna to want to use a little bit of a smaller bay leaf here because you want it to fit into your singing bowl really perfectly. So what we're going to do is write an affirmation, write dollar signs, whatever it is that you want to write. So for this one, I'm gonna be a little bit different. I'm going to write, I am a money magnet and you see that i wrote that really quickly and what i'm gonna do is write my full name right on top of everything i just wrote so you can't really tell anything it's fine if it looks like scribbles as long as you know what you wrote and what it's meant for and then what you're going to do is along with your cash you want to drop your bay leaf into your singing bowl and here's where we're going to create magic Basically, sound is very, very powerful when it comes to energy. Sound can change our mood. Sound can change so many things. Sound can change the frequency. Sound can change the vibration, you know? So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna work with sound and frequency. So what you're gonna do next is play your bowl. That's it. So I'm gonna play it for you really quickly. So you can do it for however long you want. You could do it just for a minute, a few seconds, whatever that is. But automatically, like um, when you play a singing bowl, you feel it in your body. Like you feel lighter, you feel this, I don't know, whenever I play the singing bowl, I kind of feel like a noodle, like everything just relaxes. Um, and what you just did is you filled the vibration of your home with money energy, with the energy of the bay leaf. So that's so powerful, you guys, I can't even tell you. So now your bay leaves are charged with the frequency of cash and your bay leaf is ready to burn. So what I'm gonna do is just attach it to my scissors really quickly, get my lighter and you burn your bay leaf. This is my favorite way to do it, but I like, I don't do this all the time because it is so powerful. Um, and also like you have to get your singing bowl ready, your cash, and it, it takes a little bit um, to prepare everything, but I mean, it's so worth it. It works so, so good. And the fifth way that I wanna share with you guys how to use bay leaf to manifest is by using the Sri Yantra. So the Sri Yantra is a very, very powerful, sacred geometric pattern. It's like the geometric pattern of creation. It's very high vibration. It, it It's a connection to source. Um, yeah, so it, you can use it to attract money, love, anything really and so what we're going to be using it for is to attract money so what i like to do is keep a yantra plate or a yantra something a photo or something right um and if you don't have the sri yantra plate or photo you can actually just pull up a photo on your phone and just use your phone for this basically what you want to do is have your bay leaf kind of touch the yantra and what i like to do is leave this on the yantra like overnight so it's fully absorbing the energy it's charged um and then you can actually write 
your affirmation on the bay leaf and then put it on the yantra or you could just do it blank whatever you choose it's up to you if you want to amplify this you can actually put cash near it too um, and then what you want to do is just burn your bay leaf after that like you can even have it charging for just five minutes if you're like in a rush and you just want to do this quick um, but I would suggest to meditate on this take your time let the energy fester you know things like that so I would kind of do it overnight um, and then the next thing you want to do is just burn your bay leaf since they have just been charging there for like a minute or two they still have a little bit of that yantra energy so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put a dollar sign there and a dollar sign there now you could do that just simple and quick or you could write a whole affirmation or you could write a dollar amount whatever it is remember it has to excite you okay and then the next thing we're going to do is get our fire safe bowl you want to keep your yantra around when you do this so i like to just keep it around the bowl just make sure that it doesn't catch on fire or anything like that and then basically you just burn your bay leaf your charged bay leaf there you go so those are five ways that you can use bay leaves to manifest money to attract money these are personally things i've used myself and they've worked and they're very very amazing these are things i've recommended to a lot of my clients that i do readings for it's worked for them and i wanted to share this with you guys now if you guys want more rituals like this i have a whole entire book like i said in the beginning of the video go get that book because it has 30 different rituals where you can use the yantra bay leaves you can use candles you can use how you can amplify your scripting what herbs go in a money herbal blend like i have all that fun stuff in that book for you guys so thank you guys so much for watching head over to my patreon if you're interested head over to my store if you're interested and thank you guys so much for supporting me i love you guys so much and happy manifesting bye